Many of us can't perform without our morning cup of coffee. However, while coffee brought on the go may be the kickstart to the day that we need, the waste produced as a result is hugely damaging to the environment. I've travelled to Brighton to meet Lee Gardner, who's going to tell me more about the dangers that these present. You've got the, 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 the brown layer is a paper which is easily, easily recyclable. You've got the top which is uh, polystyrene. Now polystyrene, there is so minimal amounts of uh, plastic companies that actually recycle polystyrene. It's cheaper for manufacturers to make new polystyrene than it is to, to recycle it. It's because it's so lightweight, once it gets broken down, it, it then turns into this smaller amount. It's just not worth the companies doing it. So they just need to stop making polystyrene lids. The UK throws away 2.5 billion cups a year. The mixture of paper and plastic in their inner lining, designed to make them both heat and leak proof, also makes them difficult to recycle. But are people aware of this? I went back to London to speak to members of the public. Yes, I actually think it's recyclable, uh, partly because of the brown colour, and that's usually, that's usually sort of a sign that it's recyclable. I've seen it before, and also pizza boxes and stuff. There's more paper, this fills more plastic. I, w I agree with her. This looks recyclable. This is paper down here, though. I don't know about the lid, but yeah, I say the rest of it as well, but not the lid. When we told them they were wrong, were they surprised? I might also think twice when I receive one of those cups um, because also first off I thought that it would have been recyclable but... Whoa! Even though it's recyclable? Oh that happens a lot. Why <laughs> that is happens that? More. So I think it depends on whether or not they brand themselves as, as having recyclable cups. So they're kind of tricking you because this part isn't... Well it is but they'd have to take it apart. So what can we do? So if, if you have that opportunity then try and take your time and have the coffee indoors or in a coffee shop. Until definitive action is taken by the government, it's up to us, the consumer, to buy our coffees responsibly. Many coffee shops now give you a discount for bringing a reusable cup along. If it's a Monday morning pick-me-up you're looking for, it's hard to say no to caffeine and a discount.